last January I was up in this area, I kept hearing, I kept hearing vocal sounds up in that way. And over in that direction, I caught on my camera what looked like a Bigfoot watching me from behind a tree. I've been trying to come up here to, up in here to, right in this spot. But I just couldn't make it that day. I'm so out of breath I couldn't make it up here. Well, I made it up here now. And we've been sitting here for the last hour or so. Looking around, I haven't really seen anything. But this big old boulder is what I was trying to get up to that day. And while I was sitting there watching, I kept noticing right up here, there's like a cave underneath there. And we're gonna go up there this time and check this out. Yes. It is a cave. It is a cave underneath there. Oh, that'd be big enough for something to crawl in and hide. And this one here. This looks like it goes back up in there. Oh my. I got a light on here. A little bit of a light. Is it on? Is the light on? No, it's not. It's not on? I can't tell when it comes on. Yeah, there it's on. I think this off my hand here. I'll crawl up in here. Check this out. Oh my! Oh my, look how big this is! Chris, what is this laying in here? What is this? Hair. There's hair. So long silver is hair. There's more in here. Careful. There's more hair. Huh. What what this could be from? I don't know. You like a lot. It's a long course here. Are you gonna collect it? Well, you know what? We're out here looking for signs. Here's, here's a piece of matted up hair here. <sighs> like, do I have the camera on zoom? No, it's just that close. This is kind of matted up here. Whoa. You know, you know that sighting we had, I had, that got me interested in this, yeah. that one winter day, that creature was this color. The one that was walking through the pine trees in February of 2010. It was this color, a grayish white color. This... He's been sleeping in here. Did you got that plastic bag? Yeah. We're gonna have to collect this. I'm gonna get it. I can get it all if I can. Get the bag open. Almost. <sighs> okay. I got it. Okay. Yeah. Hang on. And uh, the bag. That's a blob of fur. This one's matted up here. I wonder how. Probably wet and dirty. It's all been in the mud or something. This one's all matted up. Put that in there. Whoa. Oh, 
That's the first time in here I've ever found hair in one of these caves. I think he's been in here. Oh, that's kind of weird. This rock, right? This rock sticking up at the right angle. You know what that looks like, Chris? What? It looks like a Bigfoot head. It does. <laughs> that's weird. Well, <clears throat> quiet. You never know if they're up there watching or not. I just saw one. You see, it started away. Chris. <clears throat> I'm backing out now. Watch out. Hey, where's that matted hair at? Let me see that piece of matted hair. And the sunlight not glare on my thing here. That's the matted piece. The leaf stuck to it. We're keeping this. Open the bag up. Okay, pull that up carefully so you don't lose it. I get kind of nervous now. They could be standing. There could be one standing up above us. And we'd never know it. They could drop something on us and jump right down on us. We need to go get this hair put away. That. I think there was a Sasquatch sleeping up in there. That is the best find I've had for quite a while. 